everyone, I'm Sanjana. I'm here to talk to you about mindfulness. What is mindfulness and how can you incorporate it into your everyday lives? So to me, mindfulness is the idea that you're really present at all times. You're not only aware of your surroundings, but you're aware of how they make you feel. And you're able to use that and use how you feel to create positive change within yourself. That's always been really important to me because, you know, I'm always trying to change and grow. And I think taking some time every day to incorporate mindfulness into my routine really, really helps with that. So now that we know what mindfulness is, I wanted to take a minute to describe a few different ways I incorporate it into my everyday and maybe one of those ways could help you as well. So the first way is that every morning after I wake up, before I check my phone, before I check my calendar, I always go through a little exercise um, to focus on myself because it's really easy to get caught up in the world around us. There's so much going on and it's always healthy to take a minute and appreciate how you feel in any given moment. You might feel a little bit silly doing this exercise. I always do when I'm not usually on video. It's all right, we're all here together, so let's get started. So first, you close your eyes, and you're gonna relax all of your muscles one by one, starting from your feet, going all the way up to your head. And you're gonna pay attention to how every single muscle feels. I like to imagine I'm putting all my weight into my feet. I'm letting them drop to the floor and relax. And you do that working all the way up your body into your calves, your knees, your thighs and hips, your lower back, your upper back and your shoulders. That one always gets me. And then your neck and your face. And then you kind of just tense everything up again and you let it go. And that's a really great way to start your day by thinking about you. The thing that I really like to do is I like to take some time every day to write in this notebook that I have. And it doesn't need to be fancy, um, it doesn't need to be a lot either, I usually do one or two sentences. And if you don't like writing, you can even draw if you prefer, that's just as helpful. So I usually like to write one or two sentences about myself and how I'm feeling about myself. And sometimes you might read it and you'll think that's really negative, that you shouldn't think about yourself like that. But it's totally alright, because I think those bad thoughts and I let them go on the page and they're gone. And then some days when you're thinking really positive thoughts and you write them down, it's really nice to be able to go back and look at them and remind yourself of how strong you really are. And I've always found that helpful. Those are my two favorite tips for how to incorporate mindfulness in your everyday. But of course, mindfulness doesn't need to be scheduled. Some of the best moments are when it's not. One thing that I've really been trying to do recently is if I'm walking somewhere or if I'm driving somewhere by myself, I won't listen to music and I won't be on my cell phone. And I will instead pay attention to how I'm feeling. If I'm feeling warm or cold or even if I'm having any negative thoughts, I acknowledge them and then I let them go. If I'm thinking anything positive, then I really hold that close. And this can be done not just when something exciting is happening, but when you're just walking down the street. Because there is joy in realizing, oh, I'm really happy right now. And, you know, continuing to develop a connection with yourself. And that's been really rewarding for me. And I hope you can find something positive in it as well.